Thank you everyone for watching this video and being here with us today. My name is Stuart Crawford. These are my good friends and partners, Ryan Madrid and Jeremy West. We are unbelievably excited to announce that effective today, our new mortgage company, Bison Ventures, is go. So how did we get here? That's a question I keep asking myself. And to give you a little bit of background, I've been in the mortgage business for 20 years. It's hard to say that out loud. And Ryan and I joined up years ago and partnered on our existing business, the Crawford team, and we're very proud of what we've built and the people that we work with. That being said, for a few years now, it's been burning inside of us, what's the next step? We've tried to think through what that next level is going to look like. Simultaneously, one of my childhood friends, Jeremy, and I have talked for years, just sort of what if scenarios, what if we had the ability to work together and had that opportunity, and how fun would that be, and what could we accomplish? A window of opportunity opened and I made the decision I had to do something about it, not knowing where it was going to lead. And as I started thinking through this, I started talking to Ryan more about it and getting the three of us together on the same page to see how could the three of us do something dynamic and something very different that would get us all excited. One of my favorite sayings, which is intent without action is daydreaming. And I did not want to be guilty of daydreaming on this particular one. It meant too much to me. I think it's also important that we talk about the fact that Jeremy and I really didn't know each other. So you had the stress of knowing that, okay, I've got my two good friends. How am I going to like make this work and make sure that everybody's, you know, in peace and harmony, so to speak, right? Stab was really adamant that to make this work, it really took all of these different personalities, what we bring. And so uh, there's a lot of pressure to figure out, you know, how am I going to fit in? Uh, what's this Ryan character? Uh, <laughs> I want to, you know, I want to <laughs> make sure I'm, I'm living up to my part as well. Um, yeah. Bottom line is, man, it's just been a natural fit and I uh, feel really, really grateful to be working with these guys. When you go down a path like this, it's very natural for the people around you to ask you why. Why are you doing this? And sometimes that's not the easiest question to answer. And when I think about that, you know, I, I had summarized it for myself into three things that I thought would it just let somebody know very quickly, this is why I want to do this. Control of our own destiny, control of blazing our own path and having the freedom to make the choices that we want to make, but knowing that that comes with a big responsibility as well. So you're right. Obviously, control is a big one for all of us. Um, legacy was the big one for me out of the three. Um, and I think because maybe because I'm a little bit older than you guys, um, as I'm getting older, for sure, some of the things started resonating in my mind going, man, I, am I doing everything that I want to do? I'm from here. Um, is this, am I leaving a legacy for, for my family, my friends, just, just the community in general? And it just me meant more and more and more to me as I was getting further into our career, further into our business. And right, it just leads to what, I just don't want to leave any regrets. Yeah. You know, we, we had a heart to heart, uh, you know, all of us about kind of this opportunity and, and we really started to hash it out. And I remember Stuart, you said, I just don't want to look back when I'm 70 and be on that rocking chair and say that I wish I took the chance. I'd rather I take the chance no matter where it takes me. And uh, it stuck with me. I thought for a while, again, I've been in corporate America forever. We're 40, you know, we're in our 40s. We're I'm not gonna have these, these opportunities. <laughs> um, You're way closer to the rocking chair. what I chair. said before. It, it just became so real. And, and I think for me, it was like, we either get comfortable knowing we're not gonna take this shot. Exactly. Or we actually yeah. get the confidence to do it. Something that tugs so much at Ryan and I is our loyalties and our friendship with the founders of VIP Mortgage, who have been our mentors for most of our mortgage career. All of mine. All of his. Actually, one of them, all of mine too, actually. Yeah. So um, that was just very important to us that we looked at that and said, what if, what if we could figure out a way to check those three boxes, but do it with the guys that have had our back since day one wouldn't that be the, just the most amazing, harmonious situation we could think of? We had the conversation. We laid out what we're looking to do, not fully knowing where this is going to go. And there's a lot of unknowns there, a little bit of fear. And true to form, without even hesitation, they looked us right in the eyes and said, we get it. We totally understand. Let's try to figure this out. That was pretty amazing. Naturally, what happens next is you start to share, right, with your friends and your, your mentors and your family. This and what's true. the first question they ask? What's the name of the company? What, is, what are you going to name it? And uh, ultimately, uh, these two were telling a story uh, about how they'd heard uh, that there was an animal, right? An iconic American animal, a powerful animal 
that one of its traits was when a storm was coming, it immediately charged the storm, right? And it knew that that was the fastest way to get through it. The mortgage industry is crazy. It's chaotic. We want to try and herd everybody around us and our clients and take them through the, that storm, get them to the other side as fast as we can, because again, that's going to be the best experience. What did we want? We wanted something that was iconic, right? We're all from the Southwest. We wanted something that kind of resonated uh, with the Southwest and Western America. We wanted something powerful. Right, something that we could get excited about. Textbook definition of ventures is undertaking a, a risky or daring journey. And as Jeremy said, you know, we've always thought the mortgage business is highly complex. There's a lot of moving pieces, just like a storm, and can be very stressful. So, um, not only did ventures we felt like matched what we're doing, going off on this journey and this adventure, but also it 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 had a correlation to our clients, right? Helping them go through the same kind of kind of deal. So, what exactly is it that we do? We want to be the leaders in informed mortgage lending. Being in this business as long as I have, I've had a front row seat to see how hard it can be on the consumer because there's so many moving pieces when you're trying to get a mortgage. Informed lending to us is providing comfort and clarity in the storm of complexity. It's taking a collaborative and educational approach to the entire client journey. We've prided ourselves over years to building a client journey that's customized specifically for the person that's in front of us because every single client's needs and parameters are totally different. So we have to be able to accommodate that and be able to do that with speed and accuracy and make sure at the end of the day, they left remembering how we made them feel and we answered all their questions and had the heart of a teacher and ensured that they had total comfort throughout the process. Bison Ventures is located in Scottsdale, Arizona. We've been here a long time and we're excited at the opportunity to double down on this community and keep serving the people who have given us the opportunity to do so and hopefully be able to serve a lot more of you. What kind of mortgage company are we? We're an independent mortgage bank. What does that mean? It means that we control the whole process from A to Z, from loan application to pre-qualification to the decision on your loan to funding your loan and making sure everything happens on time as seamlessly as we possibly can. Having that kind of control means a lot to us because we want to feel comfortable in the process as well. And the only way that we can feel that way is by knowing that it's our people and our team that are directly involved in the entire journey for you. So hopefully you guys can see how excited we are to go on this new venture together. And we just want to say thank you to our past clients and thank you to our referral partners, our family and friends who've been through this process with us, which has been a little bit more than we might have thought it would have been. And thank you to our existing team because every single person on our team is coming with us on this new journey. And uh, you know, so we just wanna say thank you to all of you as well. And we are very excited that you're as pumped as we are. So thanks again to everybody out there. Uh, we appreciate you taking the time to watch this video with us and uh, hopefully we'll see you soon. So thanks and goodbye.